The Centers for Disease Control and Prevention signaled the start of flu season. The number of cases is on the rise, and with so many gatherings in the days ahead, WKBN 27 First News reporter Nadine Grimley looked into some tips to protecting yourself and your family. According to the CDC, Ohio is now one of 18 states reporting regional flu activity. So we've seen an uptick uh, with that in the past few weeks. Dr. Mike Sevilla with the Family Practice Center at Salem says those numbers will likely keep rising. This is the, typically the, the, uh, the time of year uh, that we would see um, uh, flu tests positive go up and hospitalizations go up. As of the week ending December 15th, there were 67 influenza associated hospitalizations, 10 of them in the northeast part of the state. That data coming from the Ohio Department of Health. We've been uh, telling our patients for a long time to look out, you know, because the flu numbers are going to be going up, and so we're officially in flu season now. Symptoms include high fever, chills, and coughing. Doctors say it's particularly dangerous to babies and the elderly. So be aware if you're heading to holiday gatherings. If you're very sick, you know, or if you think you're going to be around vulnerable populations, you may even want to stay home for those events, even in this holiday season. Sevilla says good hand washing is also a way to protect yourself, and it's never too late to get your flu shot. In Salem, Nadine Grimley, WKBN 27 First News.